Welcome to this Q&A of the day video in association with TLC Electrical Wholesaler, renowned for quality, value and customer service. In today's video, we're going to answer a question related to the Signify Coreline LED High Bay Gen 4 that we featured as part of one of our lockdown live feeds, and it's this. How do I decide the correct light level for an industrial area? Now there's a fairly simple answer to this and it's to get yourself a copy of the SLL Lighting Handbook. SLL stands for the Society of Lights and Lighting. Now you can purchase that handbook from the SIBSI website and inside there, supplemented by other specific lighting guides, you'll find suggested lighting levels covering all sorts of different environments from oil rigs to courtrooms and pretty much everything in between. These light levels are measured in a unit called the Lux, and lights themselves tend to be specified with a value called lumens. Now there's a fairly simple calculation you can do to figure out the number of lights required for a given space in a given situation. It takes into account the size of the room, the light output of the fittings measured in lumens, the type of environment that they're installed in and how often they're cared for, along with other factors. However, there's lots of other things to be taken into account, such as uniformity, or how evenly spread the light is, glare, so that you don't dazzle operators such as forklift drivers, and working planes. For example, the vertical spread of light is important in warehouses with racking to allow for easy reading of shelf signs. So while the calculation will give you a fairly good idea of the fittings you need, further information is usually required. Now you can contact the manufacturer and good manufacturers such as Signify will have a technical and design department to help you with your project. Most lighting design is now done using software. As we've said, you can consult the information from the Society of Lights and Lighting and using this information you can of course carry out your own lighting design using industry software, the most popular being Dialux and Relux. Dialux is my personal favourite. Now there's also more to consider with the fittings themselves. For example, the Signify fitting featured in our main video has various optics available that soften the light and reduce glare, creating a more comfortable light to work under. Also, they have two types of beam angle available, 55 degrees, suitable for illuminating the paths between racking, or 90 degrees for lighting a larger flooded area. All of these things will affect the light level in different areas of the space in different ways. So the full answer is find the correct light level from the SLL lighting handbook, get any relevant information that the manufacturer may be able to give you, and then use calculation software to figure out how many lights are required. Now, as always, we want to hear from you. So if you've got any comments or questions or experiences relating to lighting, then please leave a comment below or through our usual social platforms. All that remains in this video is to say, Thank you very much for watching.